counsel for the appellant accused submitted that the learned special judge failed to appreciate the evidence correctly and erred in holding the accused guilty of the offences the sgl information concerning the security repurchased by the yuko bank on 5th april 1991 was received on 12th april 1991 since there used to be a number of transaction by the client broker and the repurchased sgl information was received after a gap of about one week a clerical and bona fide mistake was committed by the appellant accused in getting the securities created into the sgl account number 065 instead of account number 032 of the yuko bank there was no participation by the accused in the conspiracy to benefit accused number 3 harshan mehta it was purely a clerical error that occurred in a casual way without any bad intention in a normal way the accused signed the covering note dated 13 april 1991 also signed by accused number 2 enabling the rbi to create the securities into sgl account number 65 the accused appellant has no bona fide or dishonest intention to commit any fraud or cause loss to the yuko bank or to cheat it the mistake happened mechanically without the conscious involvement of the appellant it is also evident from the record that accused number 2 himself admitted in his statement under section 313 crpc that it was he who struck off account number 032 and wrote account number 065 in covering note thus the appellant cannot be charged with severe punishment for a reasonable clerical mistake para change learned counsel also submitted that the appellant was not concerned with the routine work of the hanan street branch of the yuko bank he was specially entrusted the duties of redemption and reconciliation of securities while discharging those duty when the appellant notice the mistake he immediately facilitated transfer or row of rupees 2 crore on 15 july 1991 from the account number 065 to account number 032 to set the right record para change learned special judge has failed to appreciate the fact in a true spirit that the sgl transfer forms concerning the securities sold by harshan mehta to the tune of rupees 15 crore from sgl account number 065 were not signed by the appellant and the appellant has no role in red transaction this fact itself clearly establish that the appellant was not part of any conspiracy with the accused number 3 but the special judge took a different and wrong view and erred by holding that the appellant transferred security worth rupees 
टू करोड़ लाइंग इन द अकाउंट नंबर जीरो सिक्सटी फाइव टू अकाउंट नंबर जीरो थर्टी टू टू कवर अप द ट्रांजेक्शन देर वॉज नो एविडेंस ऑन द रिकॉर्ड टू इस्टेब्लिश अ लिंक बिटवीन द एक्यूज एपलेंट एंड द एक्यूज नंबर थ्री हर्षद मेहता फॉर्मिंग अ कॉन्स्पिरेसी बिटवीन दैम एंड द प्रोसिक्यूशन हैज अटरली फेल्ड टू प्रूव दिस आस्पेक्ट एंड दे फोर द एपलेंट इज एंटाइटल्ड फॉर बेनिफिट ऑफ डाउट फर्दर कंटेंशन ऑफ द लर्नड काउंसिल इज दैट द एपलेंट वॉज ओनली एन असिस्टेंट मैनेजर ऑफ द बैंक एंड इम्प्लीमेंटिंग द डिसीजन टेकन बाय द सुपीरियर्स